Hello guys, it's Cody. In this video, I'm gonna show you uh, web browsers for iOS that supports a Temper Monkey script. So first is this wire browser. You see, uh, it's available in the App Store for iPad and iPhone. You got a five star review. Let me just open it. Uh, let me go to settings. And you can see scroll down to the scripts. You can hit the plus icon to add your custom scripts. Or you can go to temp uh Grease Folk web Grease Folk Grease Folk website. And you can search for scripts. So here let me just add this smart dark mode script. Let me just tap install the script. Install script. Are you sure you want to install smart? dark mode install tap install okay it's installed successfully let me go to another website and go to youtube i ah, you see i'm um, refresh hey you see that's that ah, let me go to this website and refresh you see it's in the dark mode also you see uh this is a web uh mobile web browser it can also uh enable desktop mode you see it says still uh, ask you to uh, go to the google doc app another uh, i like this web browser because you can also tap the tools you see users agent i can select mac os windows let me just Choose Mac OS. And uh, go to Docs. You see. I can use uh, Google Docs. Without uh, download the Google Doc, Docs app. So you can also in tools you can also have the Wii Council, you see here element network storage system log. You can also view the source code, view source code here. Yes, this uh, is quite uh, you see you also has a dark mode. Uh, have a built in dark mode of this browser. This is a totally free browser, and the, another web browser supports user script is this called a uh, gear web uh, browser. However, this uh, this user script uh, feature is available only in the gear pro, it's a paid feature. You see, add ons high performance user script engine compatible with Temper Monkey unlocks. Unlimited features, uh, back mode. This uh, is a paid uh, feature. Oh, I don't, I didn't get this, so I cannot show you. Uh, you can use the free web browser, uh, this web browser, or you can add the Safari extension stay here to add your user script. Okay, that's uh, pretty much it for this video. Hope you find it helpful. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.